let's raise our collars up, adjust the bow tie to the setting for you. Uh, my neck is 15 inches. And place the bow tie around your neck. So you will need one long side and one short side. So we will just go like this. The short side should just come up. Imagine this is a fish, the tail and the body and the head. And it's just at the point of the head should be level with the button for the short side. Uh, then you take the long side over the short side and up through the middle. At this point, you just need to tighten it. You won't get a chance later on. And we can just leave that draped over the shoulder to keep it out of the way. Now you're going to make the shape of the actual bow tie. So to do that, what you're using is the tail here and then half the body. So where it's at its fattest is where you need to fold it, just like that. Now you can see some semblance of the actual bow tie. So I'll just pinch that there and bring the other end, the long end, over the top. Now the easiest way here to continue with the bow tie is to fold this over like this and just hold it pinched like so. Now this creates a loop through the back through which the other end is going to go. So for the other end, we make the same loop as we did before. We push it through the back like so. Just switch hands halfway through. go. Okay, now don't worry what it looks like at this point, because as I say before, most of it is in the manipulation. We can turn our collars down. Now firstly we need to tighten it. Now you do that by taking the two loops. You have a loop here and you have a loop here. Now one side of the loop will just pull the other bit through. That's not the side you want, you want the back of the loop. Likewise on the other side, one side will just pull the loop through and the other one will tighten it. If you pull those simultaneously, it will tighten the bow tie. There we go, now it's nice and tight. Now all you have to do is adjust the shape so that it's even on both sides. And voila, 